There's palpable tension in Edo State with just two more local government results have been awaited following the disappearance of the returning officers. The coalition agents of the PDP in Edo, Ugbeide Yama, earlier raised the alarm of the sudden disappearance of returning officers and electoral officers assigned to Uriomo local government area for September 19 polls. The officers were at the venue for the state coalition until the commission was due for a break. In the wake of their disappearance, the electoral returning officer has called for an emergency break while awaiting results Oriomo and Ovia Southwest local governments. He said he has called the Oriomo local government's election officer who said he is in the commission's office but didn't know the office. Voting in Oriomo has been beset by challenges on Saturday. In an emergency press statement at PDP Situation Room, the chairman of the campaign council and the governor of River State, Yeson Wiki, alleged that the returning officer is being heard at the INEC at the office of INEC Administrative Secretariat in the state. Wiki said it's shocking to us that the returning officer of Oreo One, after the result has been collated, came to the state INEC coalition office and before we knew it, the returning officer has disappeared. Wiki also retweeted his call on INEC not to declare the results inconclusive as that could result to violence in the state. INEC shouldn't in any way try to declare this election inconclusive. We will not accept it because everybody knows what everybody knows who has won the election. He also called on the public international organizations to prevail on INEC to stand on the right thing and bring out returning officer to announce the results already collated. Real one is one of two local government areas from where results of voting are yet to be declared. The other is Ovia Southwest. Of course, guys, um, this man has already won. Because as we speak now, as we speak right now, the other result has come out from a Oreo one and it's remaining one. So let us see what will happen. But I don't know whether the man has already come out uh, or is still in hiding because I don't know why he's running and where he's running to. You know, this is just an embarrassment. I don't know why they don't even want to just do the right thing and just leave. For, okay, from that Orion World Local Government, uh, APC accredited uh, registered uh, votes is 11,000. Okay, 11,000, 11,867. Uh, okay, it's okay, 180, okay, 118,671 registered votes, but accredited is 24,868. Uh, from there, uh, APC got 10,458, while PDP got 13,445. So, <laughs> that means this man has gotten almost like a 13, 13, 13, 13 local governments. So, the remaining one. So, whether it is the remaining one that uh, the returning officer, whether it's the one who is running away. So, but what we know is that the election should not be inconclusive according to what people really want because that has been the pattern before now but you know i think the only thing the only thing that saved obaseki or that is going to save obaseki is the people it's not because of anything forget all those uh, whatever even wiki that came because i'm sure of course uh, uh, politicians that uh, they are always uh, optimistic no matter the situation they are never pessimistic they are always having that strong faith even when things are going even in the other way that is not going to be favorable to them they would still stand so in this case it is just the people it is all about the people it is the people if the people can say oh this is what we want but unfortunately most of the time we are so sentimental you know uh and we get it wrong at times but if the majority of the people will come out it's not by quarrel it's not by fight it's not by violence or whatsoever but once we are united because at the end of the day we always talk about these people. At the end of the day, they will see men good together. They will see be friends. But the things that the masses need from them is the is the good governance. If the good governance is not there, that is why you see that a lot of things are going on in this country. And some some one analyst was saying that apart from maybe what Oshomole did or whatever, that APC is not even doing well at the center. See all the things happening. Is that the same people that you want to say you want to go and vote for? And secondly, this. A state has always been PDP state. There was just a break in transmission when it happened. But at the end of the day, Oshomole is even the one who has come to put a petrol inside fire and it has escalated. And with you know the campaign slogan, 
since 2016, you know, it's not something that uh, people will, you think people will forget. No, people don't forget. You will not come back and, as if you are, you are telling uh, people who do not have brain, who do not think. Of course, we still have a few gullible ones who are just there, you know, because of what they want to get. And they begin to, you know, they will see support, uh, support them. And don't forget that even the devil himself has a fans. So it is not a, it's not a new thing. You know, you can imagine, I'm, I was so surprised because to me, whosoever that wins, that is even the reason. Like me, I don't have problem with any of them because I know that they are friends. They will still mingle together because, you know, their slogan and their motto, they will tell you no permanent friend or permanent enemies. What is constant is interest. And if you continue to support them or whatever, you know, at the end of the day, it's not going to, they are not going to even know you. But we know that some of them see do little, little things. And those little things, we are still saying that it's not really enough for us to say, yes, indeed, we are where we are supposed to be. So that is just uh, the way it is. At the end of the day, let's see what happens. Uh, the remaining local governments, how they are going to do it, the tactics, the technicality they might want to use to rig this election because PDP has been crying out. PDP has been saying all manner of things. People know what is obtaining. But I think it's going to be a, a, a big a celebration for PDP that at last the old South South <laughs> is for PDP and it speaks volume. It really, really speaks volume. So, uh, Edo people, you guys have tried. You have tried at this junction. <laughs> we don't know what is going to happen in the next minute, but at this junction, kudos to you guys. Kudos to, to you guys. You guys, you have made, you have, you have proved that yes, Edo no be Lagos. You have proved that yes, you are indeed you are people of your ways. That nobody will come and dictate for you. Uh, the end of Godfatherism, yes, is is buried, died, and somebody was even saying that Oshimole had already killed the Godfatherism in that state, but he wanted to uproot it, but it's been killed finally, at the uh, end of a uh, Godfatherism. So that is just the way it is. It's 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 so surprising that now the returning officer is nowhere to be found. To so go to where you must come out anywhere you you must come out. No matter, it's better to come out because it's not even going to help them because, you know, the, the, the victory is already there. So whether you run or you don't run, the victory is already there. And any form of tactics they might want to use, it's not going to work. Hmm. It's over. PDP all the way. Congratulations to Obaseki. Oh, hmm. <laughs> people will tell you that uh, people don't vote online. That uh, online does not uh, does online voting does not count. But this one it counts because you could see the atmosphere. This is one of the elections that is shaking the whole country. You know that a lot of people are really interested in. And believe you me, everybody is. You know people will not be surprised that uh, Obaseki is winning. But some people will still be surprised because they believe that oh this guy oh he has he has done this he has done that. A lot of people when. The issue, issue of uh, lawmakers came up. Oh, they were like, yes, yes, that's good for him. They are going to teach him lesson. But all of those things, they, don't, they did not work out. Where are they? All those local, all those 17 lawmakers, they couldn't even win their local government for them. So what are we talking about? Leave your comments below, guys, and let us know what you think about the returning officer that has absconded.